Get ready to receive. Hello everyone, Robert Zink, Miracle Mentor and Alchemy Life Coach. And today, we are soaring high like a big, beautiful eagle flying in the direction of your dreams and your goals. Are you ready to receive? Receiving, for many people, is a difficult experience. They're good at giving, they're good at doing, they're good at following through, but they're not so good at receiving. Are you one of those people you're not so good at receiving? I want you to get ready to receive. First, we covered this in a podcast a few weeks ago, but it's so important, it's so critical. I am worthy. I am absolutely worthy of receiving abundance and prosperity, love, good vibrations, health, vitality in my life. I want you to believe in your heart of hearts that you are worthy because you are a spark from divine source. You were created by divine source. As the ancients say in the various scriptures, in this image, in the image of the Elohim, you were created. So keep that in mind, that there is never a time that you are not worthy of love, of abundance, of happiness, of joy. I know you're saying, Robert, I've done some bad stuff. I've been a bad person. I understand. But guess what? You are worthy. You are worthy because of your birthright. Your birthright makes you worthy. And that's all you have to know. So repeat it to yourself every day. Feel it as you walk down the street. I am worthy. Get ready to receive. I operate through inspiration. In other words, my life is no longer on automatic pilot. I'm not just going to work because I have to pay the bills. This is who I really am. Look, you've heard this before. You've heard me say it before. I'm going to say it again. If you knew you couldn't fail, what would you do? Operate your life through inspiration, which simply means to be in the spirit, to be passionate about everything you do. Because if you're operating through what other people tell you to do, what the rule book tells you to do, then you're not going to be happy. And you certainly won't achieve the greatness that is within you. Get ready to receive. Number three, I am open to receiving in ways I can't even imagine. Good things are coming into your life right now. And you have no idea how they're going to happen. You don't have to know. You need to have a sense of peace and trust. You need to open those wings up and say, I'm a high flyer and I trust my wings. I don't know how I'm going to pay the bills next month, but I'm going to pay the bills and have money left over. I don't know how I'm going to buy that new car that we so desperately need, but I'm going to buy that new car and always have money for gas. Whatever you put at a, as a limitation, take it to the next notch. I don't know how my husband is coming back to me or my wife is returning back to me. I have no idea. 
but I know they're coming back and we're going to have an incredible, loving, absolutely astonishing relationship together. I have absolute certainty of it. Number four, I see clearly my dreams and goals. I want you to see them in detail. In detail. See intimate details about your dreams and your goals. If you're moving into a new neighborhood, are you living in a cul-de-sac? What kind of neighbors do you have? How many rooms do you have? What color is the house? Do you have grass? Do you have rocks? Do you have a landscaper? Do you have a pool? Okay, what's in the house? What kind of kitchen do you have set up? I want you to flesh out the details and I want you to do it every single day. That's a big key. Every single day. Finally, I'm grateful for love and abundance that is just flowing. Take a deep breath in. Love and abundance is just flowing through my life. When you take that deep breath, that clearing breath throughout the day, in through your nose, out through your mouth. I want you to feel that gratitude, that love, that abundance, just flowing through your energy field. You have no idea the greatness that's in store for you, the happiness that's in store for you. I want you to get ready to receive. You know, it wasn't too long ago that Rachel and I had a simple wooden box in our bedroom made out of cedar. Now, cedar is nothing special, but it is a wood of abundance. And she wasn't pregnant, and we started buying baby clothes. We were getting ready to receive. And we started putting baby clothes and little rattles and toys in this cedar box. We still have the cedar box. It's a cedar trunk. It's at the foot of the bed. And again, nothing special about it. What was special is that we got ready to receive even before there was any evidence that we would receive such a wonderful gift as Julian. Oh, I can't think of anything more precious in my life. Well, yeah. hard to pick, you know? <laughs> anyway, I love you all. Thank you so much. Get ready to receive and have a great day because you absolutely deserve it. Bye-bye.